This Impressionist Renoir painting was bought for next to nothing at a Virginia flea market in 2009. Marcy up Martha Fuquay bought Pierre Auguste Renoir's Paysage Bar de Seine for just seven U.S. dollars, but the soiled napkin-sized work of art has actually been valued at up to $100,000. In 1951, it was stolen from the Baltimore Museum of Art. On Friday, Judge Leonie Brinkema dismissed Fuquay's claim of ownership and said the painting must be returned to the museum. Baltimore Museum of Art attorney Marla Diaz. We've had a result from the court today on our motion for partial summary judgment that has dismissed the claim of the owner uh, uh, who purported to buy the painting at the flea market. Uh, and as a result, the court has indicated that it will be returning the painting to the Baltimore Museum of Art, which is a decision we are very delighted about. Fuquay said she didn't know it was a Renoir and stored it in a garbage bag for two and a half years. She said she bought it because she liked the frame and thinks she should be able to keep it since she didn't know it was stolen. But the judge noted a property title cannot be transferred if it resulted from a robbery. What happened to the painting in the time after the theft in 1951 and the time it surfaced at a flea market is unknown.